Wouldn't you love to have your sales team able to read the minds of your prospects? With ClientPoint Analytics, your sales team is closer than ever to actually being able to read minds in your sales process. Let me share with you exactly how to do it right now. With analytics, you can accurately predict whether or not your prospect is going to show up to that next sales meeting with your salesperson. As an example, between meetings, it's really important to send content to your prospects, right? Well, with ClientPoint, you're able to see if and how your prospects are engaging with that content prior to your meetings. So if your prospect is not looking at your content at all, you have a good idea that they're not going to show up to that meeting and you need to follow up with them, engage them via phone call, email, or more content so they're actually viewing your content, warming back up to your sales process, and actually going to show up to that next meeting. The next question that bothers a lot of salespeople is they wonder, did my prospect actually even look at my proposal? There's typically this feeling of gambling or a little bit of anxiety as soon as they hit send on that proposal to their prospect. And once that proposal goes out as an attachment, it's just who knows what's happening now. So one of the things that you can now understand with Client Point Analytics is exactly if and when your prospects are opening up their proposals. Imagine having your sales team knowing exactly when your prospect opens up the proposal. They're able to follow up more effectively and follow up in a way that resonates with your prospect. It's always an awkward moment when your salesperson's trying to close a deal and the prospect hasn't even opened the proposal yet. So by knowing the answer to that question, has my prospect opened the proposal, your sales team can be far more effective in their follow-up process. The next natural question that salespeople ask themselves is, are the right people looking at the proposal? A lot of times we're sending proposals to influencers as much as we wish we're sending them to the decision makers themselves. But with a client point, your sales team now is going to be able to understand exactly who's looking at the proposal when and how long that person spent on the proposal. So with client point, you're going to get the analytics. You're going to know everyone in your prospect's company that is looking at the proposal. You'll be able to follow up more effectively. As another example, you can know that your influencer might need to send the proposal to their manager named Jan, and you can know exactly if and when Jan has opened up the proposal. Now your influencer might not even be aware that Jan hasn't looked at it yet, and you can now coach your influencer to help Jan open up the proposal and follow up and sell more effectively. Another question your sales team may be asking themselves is, am I really dealing with the decision maker or is this an influencer? Well, on the proposal analytics, you're going to find out very quickly based on what they're doing with their proposal, if they're the decision maker or not. And of course, you'll be able to monitor and know who the decision makers are and be able to work that deal appropriately at that point. Once your prospects are in the proposal, you probably wanna know what they care about most. One of the strange things about proposals is people think that once they send the proposal, the deal's almost done. And what we found at ClientPoint, looking at thousands of analytics across millions of dollars of deals, is that at the proposal level, it's so important that the story is told about your business. Now, we help you do that at ClientPoint. But one of the really cool things that you can do with analytics is you can see when you're sending a proposal that has a story and case studies and videos, is you can start to see what your prospect cares about most at that really critical proposal stage. So as an example, you may have somebody that says, you know what, I'm ready to sign this deal, just send me a proposal. And you may send them that proposal, but then you've got extra information on there. And I guarantee you're gonna be surprised, maybe six times out of 10, that that prospect who said they're ready to sign is spending a lot of time looking at your content prior to them signing. So with Client Point Analytics, you're going to have a much better idea on is this prospect really ready to sign or do they need more selling? Do they need more nurturing? Do they need more help in order to make that decision? It's really critical to know where they really are in the buying process versus what they're saying they are, where they're saying they are in their buying process. Lastly, as your prospect engages with the proposal, their behavior is going to change over time. So first, they may be looking at the proposal, they may be looking at your story, they may be looking at case studies, they may be looking at more how it works, but then in the later stages, they'll be looking more at price and legal. So as the evolution happens with the, with the buying journey, you're going to be able to pick that up with analytics and stay in tune with where your prospect really is. So as your prospect starts to change their behavior on the proposal, your sales team can start to change their behavior on how they're selling, communicating, and following up so that they have the most success possible at closing that deal. So these are just some of the insights you're going to be able to get with client point in your selling process. It's just like you're reading your prospect's minds. I know it's very frustrating when you're in sales and you don't know what your prospect is thinking. Now with ClientPoint and with our analytics, 
you're able to see exactly what's going on with your buyers between meetings and especially when they're looking at their proposals.